All right. <laughs> quiet. <laughs> quiet back there. Who's, who's ready to buckle up for a summer road trip? We are. All right. Well, we have some amazing vacations for your whole family will love. From Condé Nast Traveler's Deputy Global Editorial Director, Jesse Ashlock. He's here to walk or drive us through where we're going this summer. Hello. Good to be here. You I, don't I, have I to hold the wheel the whole time. I'm <laughs> driving. <laughs> you know, who drives like this? I'm really concerned about uh, going. <laughs> Exactly. First of all, you know what? Talk about the benefits of a road, of a road trip. Happy Listen, so a lot of people during the pandemic got a pandemic pet. My family got a pandemic car. And oh. like a lot of Americans, we rediscovered our backyard. Um, and now it's great that we're traveling again, but everybody's doing it. The airports are jam-packed. Mm -hmm. The TSA just had its busiest day ever. And ticket prices are way up. Meanwhile, gas prices are down a bit. And um, the road trip is still the best thing in the let's world to do, do in the summertime. So let's yeah. do it. Where are we going? So you, you got a, a suggestion for nearly every part of the country. So let's start here in the Northeast. What, what road trip do you recommend here? Well, one of my favorites is um, kind of my backyard just up the coast from us. Um, you start out in South Kingston in the Newport area, mm. and you head to Bar Harbor, Maine. Oh, I love um, Bar Harbor. And uh, Newport, um, one of the very original vacation towns. Everybody's into it again because of the show, The Gilded Age. They want to tour the iconic mansions. Been. It's great. Great in the summertime. You got Newport folk, Newport jazz in the summer. Then you drive on up 95, eat a lobster roll, Ooh. hit Portland, mm. Portland Maine. Uh, it's the kind of the birthplace of the local war movement. Uh, visit 4th Street, the restaurant. Um, and then uh, Katy National Park on Mount Desert oh. Island outside of Bar Harbor. Um, you can hike the carriage roads that the Rockefellers built um, and uh, kind of soak up that main atmosphere. And it's just beautiful. It Absolutely serene. beautiful. One of the most wonderful places the on, air on Earth. Just that. So pretty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we're going to head down south. Where are we off to? All right, we're going to start in, Na start in Nashville and head down to Macon, Georgia on uh, US 41, which is kind of like the South's answer to Route 66. Um, and it's one of those um, old highways from before the interstate system, and which has, gives it this kind of nostalgic veneer. You've got the like old motels and uh, auto camps. Uh -huh. um, and uh, Nashville, you spend some time at the Country Music Hall of Fame, one of my favorite places, gawking at like, you know, Elvis's gold caddy and oh, George Jones's nudie suits. Um, I think Chattanooga is uh, one of America's under the radar gems. Um, mm. Ruby Falls and Lookout Mountain and Rock City are a wonderful tourist attraction. They've got a great aquarium. And then head to Macon, where um, Akmulgi uh, Burial Mounds is a prehistoric Ooh. Native American site that is uh, going to be our next national park in all likelihood. I love that. Okay, so let me keep on driving here. Now let's <laughs> keep drive. Eyes on the road. Let's you keep move fast. Now let's drive to South Car or South Carolina, South Dakota God, for all get those some glasses. <laughs> Why is she driving? She can't She's see. the last person who should be driving. All right, we're going to start out in Yankton, uh, in the corner of the state, and uh, basically this is a, another kind of backroads drive on uh, Minnesota 60, which is one of the old highways. Kind of, we used to call them the Blue Roads. Um, okay. And you'll go through these picturesque riverside towns like Stillwater, Minnesota, um, and, uh, and then find your way to Lake Michigan, where you, um, you'll wind up on a, on a peninsula in between the lake and uh, Green Bay. I love Bay. this idea. These and if you've great. got time, hit Minneapolis, go to Paisley Park, Prince's oh. Home oh, and Recording yeah. Studio, go to Awamni, the sous chef, great new restaurant. Ooh. Minneapolis, one of the best cities in America. Nice. Love it. Nice, okay. Right, last but not least here, let's, let's go out west. Look at let's, 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 let's go. It's like you've never driven. <laughs> I know. Don't never, make me come back she's, there. She's never driven this I'm car before. Over this car. <laughs> let's go to Utah. Where are we going? All right, let's start out in um, Monroe near Arches National Park, one of the best national parks, but it is beloved. So um, get a reservation in advance. And uh, and pro tip: go early in the day or late in the day. The crowds are a lot thinner then, and it's actually the most beautiful time to visit the park. Um, in Moab nearby, there's this awesome new luxury glamping spot called Ulum. And then head into the heart of the Rockies and go to Telluride, which is a mining town, now probably most famous for the film festival, which happens at the end of the summer. Um, if you're a, There's wonderful hiking, and if you're a thrill seeker, they've got this awesome Via Ferrata uh, system, so you can hang on to a, uh -huh. like a metal rung on the side of a 14,000-foot wow. mountain. That sounds uh, perfectly amazing. safe. <laughs> okay. That sounds, did you guys like your road trip? This was great, Jesse. I loved it. I enjoyed Jesse. <laughs> the driver is not. You know what? <laughs> Don't make me come back turn there. Turn around. I'll go on a road trip with you guys anytime. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. All right. Can we turn on the radio? And the July August. There we go. The July August issue of Condé Nast Traveler is out now. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.